Welcome everyone back to Doom Soft. We're now entering the Alpha Lab Sector 4. How many sectors this fucking lab here has? I have no fucking clue. Alpha Lab Sector 4 seals and prepares the shipments of processed hydrogen fuel for dropship distribution to UEC bases and sub platform. The system is fully automated and personnel is access is limited due to machinery hazards. Marine, I was able to locate your position. Orcon systems are beginning to malfunction and shut down. Massive service disruptions throughout the entire base. How long I'll be able to track it? Bravo team has just entered the end program. Pick up the pace. You aren't far behind. chamber when the power went out. I don't know what's going on here. I don't understand why none of the systems are responding. I'm going to try to get an uplink into the main system from here. This is a secure terminal. Security log number 3072 for Delta Security Chief Michael Abrams, November 15th, 2145. I've just come from the Armament Division where I was issued one of the new BFG 9000 series weapons. <laughs> well, they weren't kidding about how much lighter it is over previous prototype models. Won't be so bad carrying this one around. <laughs> Anyhow, for a couple of weeks now, many of the security teams have not been following proper reporting procedures. Not sure if it's the format of the new SIR, so I'll make sure each team is scheduled by training division to get spun up on the new reports. There have been some security issues in the Alpha Labs. I sent a team over to investigate, and now I can't reach them on any comm channel. Guess I'll have to go over there myself. Well, I'm headed over there now. I'll finish the security report in full when I get back. Oh yeah, one more thing. I'm gonna leave this BFG locked in my office for now. Please have IT security change my door code to 901. Sure as hell don't need anyone messing around with it. Chief Abrams, and the law. Fair enough.
In a quest to provide armies with a well-balanced set of weapons, UAC looked to the past when designing and manufacturing the newest line of Mach 2 chain guns. The retro style and mechanical sturdiness of the chain gun is a must for all hardened combat veterans. Early adapters have nicknamed it SAW. With its armor-piercing 30 caliber bullets, the chain gun is capable of literally cutting opponents in two. Packed with all the punch you need in close combat fighting, the chain gun delivers unparalleled reliability and functionality. Always on the forefront of technology, the UAC is making safer worlds through superior firepower. Schematics show all passages out of your area blocked. The only way through is by traversing the EFR, a mechanical subsystem with two possible routes through it. 
Activating the system will get you a direct route, but it's dangerous. Extending the service bridges is safer, but the lighting systems are fried. Make a choice. Good luck.
think I got it.
boomers in the church. I'm not kidding. Communication tower, backup power, entire CRC facility, plasma canisters are also manufactured here. From the CRC power. Bravo team, entry secure. Move in and take positions. Quiet, did you hear that? This is late, give me status. Always clear. There's nothing here, Sam. No, Operation temperature exceeding safe levels. Marine, Bravo team is down. Their operational status is unknown. They we're carrying a military transmission card. It's vital you retrieve that card as it contains encoded data needed to send a distress signal to the fleet. For the last hope to get reinforcements. Find that card and find it fast. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 